When Bill Belichick attempted to function without a top-tier Tom Brady clone, he discovered, the coach's deadly mistake was believing he was so excellent that he could substitute any goat for the goat. Bill Belichick demonstrated early on the egalitarian team culture he aimed to create in New England. The St. Louis Rams show on turf offensive starters followed tradition before taking the field for Super Bowl 36, coming out of the dimly lit tunnel one by one into the spotlight to a mix of cheers and jeers interspersed with the stadium announcer's monotonous list of names. Kurt Warner and Marshall Falk received the loudest cheers. The stadium erupted as the Patriots broke with tradition and charged onto the field as a unit, for the simple reason that the 1999 season marked the first time in my childhood that I had been engaged enough to follow a season from start to finish, the Rams were the first team in which I had ever become emotionally attached. I got goosebumps. In addition to leading the Patriots to a historic upset, Belichick also laid the foundation for his philosophy of team building.